Hello guys, what's up and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, maga unbox ako ng Google Home Mini. So this one is a speaker and a personal assistant at the same time. So if curious kayo how it works and kung ano chura niya, then please keep on watching. Okay, so ayun, bago ko muna buksan yung item, papakita ko muna sa inyo yung itsura ng box niya. So, ito siya. So, yung pinili kong color is charcoal kasi first, hindi siya dimihin unlike dun sa chalk na variant. So, ayun. And I think black goes with everything. So, pinili ko is yung charcoal or yung black color. Ng Google okay, so, Home. bago ko mong buksan yung Google Home Mini Box, please make sure to subscribe to my channel, give me a thumbs up, and click on the notification bell below to get notified whenever I have new videos. So, please do. And please also follow me on my social media accounts, especially on Instagram and on Twitter. So, first, ano ba ang Google Home Mini? Okay, so, ang Google Home Mini is a speaker, but it has a lot of features. It, it is a, a voice-controlled speaker, it can recognize your own voice and you can do a lot of things with it like uh, setting an alarm reminding you of something even ask your horoscope and um, ask the weather you can do a lot of things with google home mini okay so the google home mini is powered by google assistant so pwede mo siyang tanungin ng kahit ano um it can you know, do things for you, even turning on the light if you have a Wi-Fi enabled socket or lamp. So anything, kaya niyang gawin, kaya niya control with the same network, of course. Like it should be connected with the same Wi-Fi uh, connection around your house. Okay, so wag na natin patagalim pa, buksan na natin yung box. Okay, so again, ito yung box. Uh, Bubuksan ka na siya. Okay, so nabuksan ko na yung box. At ito agad siya. Okay, so makikita nyo agad yung Google Home Mini na speaker. So, magaan siya. Sobrang gaan. Um, this one is cloth. And then, yung ilalim niya is parang silicone. Na... And then, this one is plastic. Yun. So, meron siyang USB port for power source at yung or mute and unmute button for the microphone. So, after nung speaker, tinggalin natin to. At meron siyang let's get started. Google I think manual. Yeah, this one is a manual. So, everything is here. Uh, kung ano yung mga dapat mong i-download muna sa smartphone mo. And, uh, yun says here to plug it in using the power adapter of your Google Home Mini. I think included should as a box. And then you have to download the Google Home app sa Play Store. So, it actually requires an Android phone. And some warranty. And this get to know your Google Home Mini. I think um, just you know the description and the okay, so after no warranty card at no brochures. Next is your power source now or power supply. No Google Home Mini. So I want to lay white yung plug nya. Mahaba yung cord, makapal, at micro USB yung USB type. And I think it goes here, support na to. So, you have to um, insert it here, like this, and then you have to plug it mismo sa saksak. Okay, so prior to this uh, recording, na-install ko na talaga yung app sa Android phone ko, which is the Google Home app. So, madali lang siya actually. You just have to go to the Play Store 
and type in Google Home and ayun, install nyo lang. So after nyo ma-download yung application, uh, ipaprompt kayo to customize your Google Home Mini speaker. So isa-set up nyo yung name and I think uh, the voice recognition. So you have to uh, repeat some phrases para ma-save sa memory ng Google Home Mini so, yung ngayon, voice. Uh, itatry na natin yung Google Home Mini. Sasaksa ko na siya dito sa socket. And then, ayan. Yeah. Sinaksa ko na siya. So, may LED indicator. Standby mode na yung Google Home Mini natin. So, when you tap here, I think this one is the volume up and then the right side is the volume down. So, ayun, makita nyo naman yung indicator. Meron ding LED. Maximum and the lowest. Okay, so again, uh, naset up ko na earlier yung Google Home app at yung voice recognition feature nung Google Home Mini. So, ngayon, itatry na natin kung na-recognize niya ba yung boses ko o hindi. Okay, so let's check kung na-recognize ba ni Google Home Mini yung boses ko. Hey Google, what's the weather today? In San Jose del Monte today, there will be isolated thunderstorms with a forecast high of 30 and a low of 24. Currently, it's 28 degrees and cloudy. Will it rain tomorrow? Yes, it'll rain in San Jose del Monte tomorrow from 11 a.m. to 4 a.m. with a break at 6 p.m. Set my alarm at 6 a.m. Tomorrow at 6 a.m. Set. Hey Google, play music. Playing some music on Spotify. Hey Google, what's my name? Your name is Jack. Hey Google, what's my horoscope today? All right, I have a few options for that. What's my zodiac sign, free horoscopes, Astro Sage horoscope, and more? Which one would you like to try? Astro Sage. Got it. Let's get Astro Sage horoscope. What is your zodiac sign? Scorpio. Here is your today's horoscope, Scorpio. Toothache or stomach upset may create some problems for you. Take a physician's advice to get relief immediately. Stick to your budget to avoid financial constraints. You will have limited So ayun, gaya nga na sabi ko kanina, marami kang pwedeng gawin with Google Home Mini. You can ask any questions that you have in your mind. Though, sometimes hindi naman accurate talaga si Google Home Mini. May mga times na wala siyang sagot dun sa tanong mo. But most of the time, yes, of course. Even math problems, you can even ask him math problems at kaya niyang sagutin yun within a few seconds lang. Okay, so that's it. Uh, pretty much marami kang pwedeng gawin with your Google Home Mini speaker. And do I recommend you guys to buy it? Depende sa inyo kung trip nyo. <laughs> Actually, well, trip ko nga lang kasi talaga siya kaya ako siya binili. Though, useful naman siya sa akin kasi I was able to uh, use it every day. And since nasa bahay nga lang ako, you know, pandemic, um, I'm just working from home. So, most of the time, nakasaksak lang siya. Um, connected siya sa Wi-Fi. And hindi nga pala siya gagana pag hindi siya connected sa Wi-Fi. You can only use it uh, via Bluetooth kung gusto niyo mag-play ng music. But it won't respond kung hindi siya connected sa Wi-Fi. Well, of course, if you're going to purchase it, you have to um, consider the power supply availability. So, dapat nga nakasaksak siya palagi uh, direkta sa outlet. And if you're planning to use it outside, na hindi available yung saksakan, well, you can use it, of course, with the use of a power bank. Though, hindi mo siya magagamit ng matagal using a power bank. And sometimes, pag minax mo yung volume niya, is mamamatay minsan yung speaker kasi hindi nga kinakaya ng power. 
from the power bank. So, mas um, recommended talaga na for home use only lang siya. So, for the price of the Google Home Mini, nasa around 1,500 lang siya sa Shopee or Lazada. So, it actually depends. Minsan kasi, minsan nagsisale siya, minsan hindi. So, ayun, search nyo na lang sa Shopee or Lazada na Google Home Mini. And, ayun, you can... So, sana fire. na enjoy nyo yung video ko. Thank you so much for watching this very short review and unboxing video. And, I hope uh, to see you again on my next video. So, stay safe everyone. Take care. Ayun.